Broken bitches, I don't get it, you're a star love what is up you guys welcome back to my glorious channel before we get into today's video i just want to shout out like all of you guys for watching and subscribing to my channel for commenting liking everything that you guys do to support me and let me know what videos you like and what videos you don't like um to let me know how your progress is going with your own diys and you know I just want to say thank you I'm so grateful I'm almost at a thousand subscribers and I really when I started my channel never thought that I would be like here doing this so I just want to say thank you and let's get into the video as you saw by the title I'm going to be doing a what's in my school and work bag First of all, happy Black History Month. This month, like I said, I've been wearing a lot of African prints. Um, not that I have like a lot of African print clothing, but like just what I have, I've been wearing um, a lot. This video is gonna be a what's in my bag, what's in my school slash work bag. While I'm doing the video, I'm actually gonna be transferring my stuff because it's time for me to transfer bags. Um, I was carrying a tote bag before classes started. Now that classes started, I need to go back to my book bag because my books are heavy. Here is my work bag, a nice thick black Michael Kors tote. I love this bag, it carries everything flawlessly that I have in here. I just need to transfer it because the straps are really good straps but they're thick like um, on the thinner side, like I like bulky straps for my book bag so that way it doesn't hurt when I'm carrying it. This is the bag that I'll be using. This is a book bag. So it has nice thick back straps, multiple inside pockets, and yeah, so I'm just gonna go through everything that I have in my bag and transfer it. <laughs> so the first thing that I have is my wallet, of course, to match. I'm also gonna be transferring my wallet too because um, I don't wanna carry the black wallet with my pink bag, so I'm just gonna transfer it over to that. Then I have my planner. You guys, this planner has been saving my life lately. Like, and I just feel like everything that I've been putting in my planner has actually been like manifesting itself, if that's how you want to describe it. Like, it's been really like, I don't know, coming together. I got this planner off Amazon. It was $20, which was a dupe. This is a daily bloom planner, and this planner is nine dollars on the bloom on the bloom planner site. I like this planner because it has a calendar on the inside. Let me show you a calendar on the inside for the month of the uh, month. So it's a little small calendar, and then it has um, everything uh, from January to December. Who this planner belongs to, what your um, mission statement is for your planner, for your life, for anything that's the mission statement that you're going to be working with this year. You put that there. And, and it has, which I haven't done yet, but goals for the year. And it has personal growth, health, fitness, work, school, relationships, fun, and then a blank page for you, to, a little blank slot for you to just write anything you want. A checklist for of things that you want to accomplish throughout the year. And then of course, once you check it, you just ch um, check the little box right here. I don't know what to put in the try something new section because I feel like I try new things often. I don't know. We'll, we'll see what that goes. Then they have a goal, goal tracking section and um, the acronym for BLOOM and it says be inspired, love yourself, outline your vision, organize priorities, and make it happen. And then it gives a definition of what a goal is. A goal is specific, measurable, achievable, relevant, and timely, which is SMART. If you work in the school system or anything like that, you work with SMART goals. The next page is um, 2019 things you'd like to do more and less of. And then your vision board for the year you can put, which I might actually do today actually since I have some free time. Next page, I'm gonna break down of all of the holidays. A breakdown of all the holidays and the dates. And then you have a weekly schedule that you can just put. I put the times in. I really don't have anything to do weekly except class and work. So that's my life. And it gives you a couple of those pages. Then you have note pages. I think there's about six of these front and back. And then you just go straight into the year, into the calendars. And then each section of the calendar has a note page as well. And then in the back of the journal, I mean of the 
planner which I thought was really cool actually says how I bloomed in 2019 and you can write down if you achieved your goals that you set for yourself or if you did not and then move it over to the next journal I also got some like planning stickers which goes in it just has a little flap for it in the front and in the back there's flaps so that just goes there and then I also got a bunch of um, pens for the new year too because I have pens but they're all like mismatched so I just wanted my pens to coincide with each other I guess if that makes sense. I got the these, these are my favorite pens and these are my favorite pens you guys. Papermate, Papermate pens are everything. I got the ballpoint and flare tip which let me transfer those now and then in this bag is different pockets so I normally put my pens and highlighters in these pockets and then everything else goes everywhere else then I also carry a coffee with me you guys because my job likes to run out of um, caffeinated coffee and only have decaf so Starbucks and then I have my headphones for when I'm bored at work. My Apple charger, because I carry my laptop with me because you never know when you'll have free time to do work. So my MacBook goes in here. My keys, a tissue, just because. Highlighters, like I said, I'm carrying highlighters. I oftentimes carry more colors. I don't know what happened to them. I normally have a pink one too. So I need to find that. I'm carrying um, notepads. I normally don't carry all of these, but I just, let me actually just separate these. And these normally go in to my notebook. These normally go into this notebook because it has a little section in the front for index cards. And then this is the same notebook that I carried last semester and I didn't even finish it. So I just put the flaps down and started my next semester. I like this notebook because it has three sections inside it it comes with um has a pocket oh two pockets i know it's two each divider has two pockets so you can put um papers loose papers in there um and on the front it comes with a pen holder this i did myself with washi tape because it was this color and now it just i just wanted to be festive and my first class is two Okay, so I'm gonna carry this notebook, which I also covered with washi tape. This one doesn't have um, an inside notebook, I mean an inside pocket, but I did the same thing and just flapped down the pages so that way, um, that's a good way to not have to get a new notebook and whenever you don't wanna have to keep flipping through old pages to get to the new sections. If you know what this is, you know what this is put that in there some white out oh my lipstick can go out normally my bag always has like 10,000 lipsticks in it just because in the morning I'm always rushing and I just throw the lipstick that I'm wearing in it chapstick which goes in here mints because you never know when other people's breath might be popping or yours you might just be minty fresh you know some hand sanitizer because i do work with kids and it gets germy this was my favorite pen i like to color coordinate my notes so that's why i have all those pens some hand lotion i, I don't like anything my lips my hands to be dry so i carry that my work keys more vaseline here's my highlighter more lotion i got so much lotion for christmas you guys so this a Crabtree and Evelyn hand lotion kit. Like it's just all lotions. This was amazing. I got this for Christmas from one of my students. All these Crabtree and Evelyn lotions. I carry cuticle oil as, as well, just to oil my cuticles. If the oil, like if I don't, if I can't reach for the Vaseline oil lotion in time, I just carry that. And I think that's it. Of course my phone, but my phone, is all that's a given so <sighs> thanks so much for watching this video you guys let me know down below what kind of videos you guys want to see and this year i'm going to be doing a lot more videos like not more more but like i'm going to try to hit a lot of my goals this year as far as youtube goes um but also keep in mind that i work full-time and i'm a full-time graduate student so i'll be doing as much as i can when I can. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you love it, 
sub it and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.